Uh, so good morning to each and every one. Let me introduce the group six first. This is Orok, yours truly, together with Patoy, Olmuges, Maglente, and Dentero. First, let us talk about the for the cardiovascular endurance. So, according to the DOH, that adults perform moderate intensity aerobic exercise, such as walking, a minimum of 30 minutes for 5 days per week, 8 kilometers or 5 miles. Betis. Another is we have here push up for muscular strength. It is beneficial for building upper body strength. They work the triceps, pectoral muscles, and shoulders. When done with proper form, they can also strengthen the lower back and can engage the abdominal muscles. We have here muscular endurance and one of the examples in it is running. It helps to build strong bones as it is a weight-bearing exercise, strengthen muscles, help maintain a health weight born, plenty of kelejols, so research shows a person needs to run at least a couple of times a week. So for flexibility, we have here knees to chest. First, you have to lie on your back with your knees, bent on your feet, flat on the floor. Bring one knee to your chest, keeping the other foot flat on the floor, or the other leg straight, whichever feels better on your lower back. Keep your lower back raised to the floor, hold for at least 15 to 30 seconds. And last but not the least, uh, we have here got our one of the example of the body composition, which is squats. So when it comes to how many squats should you do in a day, there's no magic number. It really depends on how individual goes. If you're new to doing squats, aim for three sets of 12 to 15 reps of at least one type of squat. Squats burn calories and might help you to lose weight. Group 6 Body Mass Index or BMI That's all. Thank you for watching. Hope you've learned something from this day.